Hello there traders, you are watching weekly stock market review on InstaForex TV channel with me, Tahmina Salomova. The US stock market showed mixed trading on Friday. The Nasdaq index added 0.1% on the back of higher share prices in Microsoft and Intel. The index stood at 5,660.78 after gaining 1.9% of the week. The blue chip Dow Jones Industrial Leverage Index dropped during the Friday traders to 20,093.78. The worst performers among the Dow components were Goldman Sachs and oil giant Chevron. Still, throughout the five-day trading period, the index rose by 1.3%. The S&P 500 fell to 2,294.69 with the oil and gas sector showing the deepest decline. The index grew by 1% over the week. Analysts point out that shares have been trading sideways since mid-December after a rally triggered by the U.S. presidential election. Despite the fact that strong corporate reports and favorable economic data support the court's market are waiting for clearer hints about the U.S. monetary policy and companies' expectations about the impact the policy would have on them. On Friday, it was revealed that the U.S. economy grew by 1.9 percent in annual terms after an advance of 3 in the previous three-month period. Analysts had projected a rise of 2.2%. The total GDP growth for 2016 was also weak. The economy expanded by 1.9% against 2.6% previously. Chevron shares decreased by 2.4% in value on Friday. The oil producing company reported fourth quarter earnings of 22 cents a share against the loss of 31 cents a share lodged in the same period of 2015. The giant's revenue increased to $31.5 billion from $29.25 billion. Despite the better figures, experts had projected strong results, earning of 64% a share in revenue of $36.96 billion. Share of Alphabet, the parent company of Google, dropped by 1.1% in value as its financial figures missed analysts' forecasts. Meanwhile, Microsoft shares rose by 2.4% in price, supported by the corporate report that showed the software developer had uh, better than expected adjusted earnings and revenue. The company's capitalization exceeded the mark of $500 billion for the first time since March 2000. You have watched weekly stock market review on InstaForex TV channel. Goodbye.